So now that we know a little bit about sorting and filtering in Google Sheets, we can try an example. So we're going to make a copy of this spreadsheet, and this spreadsheet just contains some temperature readings in different locations. So assume it's like some kind of data that someone was sampling with a thermometer in different places. And uh, we're going to make that header row bold and resize temperature reading to fit so that it kind of looks right and the header sticks out a bit. Let's go ahead and freeze one row so that header stays on no matter how far down we scroll. Uh, we're going to apply alternating colors so that we can see it a little bit better visually. And we're going to use sort range to sort by increasing time. By default, it is sorted by decreasing time. So uh, times are in reverse order. Uh, we're also going to com apply conditional formatting to uh, use this white to red color scale to the temperature values. So the lowest values are white and the highest values are red. Uh, once you've done that, apply data validation to make sure that any new temperature readings are between 0 and 120. Uh, create a filter view for location A1 that shows only location A1, uh, the same for A2 and the same for A3. When you're all done, you should have three different filter views that look like this. We have uh, our A1 location on the left, our A2 in the middle, and our A3 on the right. Uh, if you follow you know, the steps that we learned in this module, you should be able to easily create these different views and not have to duplicate all of this data over and over again. Thanks for watching.